So just chilling with my day one. Yeah. <laughs> but I hope you guys are good. My name's Echo. If you're new and you don't know, you know, this is this is me and Isaiah's. Um but yeah, we're just chilling. I'm just attempting to get ready to go into central London. I'm gonna go meet my friend Will and I've gotta go get some stuff and everything. But yeah, oh, he was little waffing. He's like so, he's so happy today. Like he woke up and he's just like all smiles and he's like super happy today. You gonna say hi? Who's who's that? Who's that? No. <laughs> such a happy boy. He's such a happy boy. But yeah, probably gonna get some food as well when we go there and everything. And you know, a girl just loves to shop. So. So already, I'm just on the train. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome to Echo's vlog. <laughs> I'm Will, I'm Will. Today we're gonna get some love back in there. Period. Period. Where's your pumpkin spice? He's a basic bitch. <laughs> Thank you. I like a gift. Mm. <laughs> you still going? How's he still going? <laughs> that is. <laughs> I love it. Run out of still. Oh, he's been going for so long. How's he still going? I'm actually dead. Yeah, that's my He's been going for time. How's he? How's it possible to do it for that long? Now he's moving brazen. He just changed lanes. <laughs> Why did they drop? No, that's what I was thinking when he's changing lanes. I was like, Hey guys! So it's like quarter past ten, and I literally just got home. Yeah. <laughs> So basically, obviously, it went um, shopping with Will and everything. We had such a nice time. We just went for some food in Camden because that's like near where he is and everything. So I just went and got him. We had some food, and then we went Selfridges. And I ended up getting what I needed to get and everything. It was just so good that they had what I needed to get in stock. Basically, it's a present for Junior for our anniversary. So I can't really say. You know, he watches these videos. <laughs> but yeah, so that was really, really good. Um, and then we went to Chinatown. We went like to some of the makeup shops in Chinatown, which was really, really cool and everything. But it was really busy. It was like really busy in Central London today. And I thought because it was Friday in the day, it wouldn't be too bad. But it was like heaving. It was really, really weird. Um, so it was kind of hard to like get around the shops and stuff. But yeah, and then Juna, like I came home on the train at like six. And so I got home at like seven. And then Juna was like, oh, we'll go somewhere so then he picked me up and we went to see his best friends a family and we spent some time with them and everything and then on the way home we literally just picked up a salmon chicken from a chicken shop and we are finally home now so it was a bit of a packed day to be fair my makeup has lasted so good like listen the shishado self like refreshing foundation is a 10 out of 10 i used to like live off samples of it and then finally the other day i checked and looked fantastic and they finally had my shade in stock because they literally just like never had my shade in stock and i bought it so quickly and it's like my favorite foundation ever and i'm so happy that i actually finally own like a full bottle of it and don't have to live off samples anymore <laughs> but no my makeup's held up so good i've actually had this on since 12 and it's now 10 bruh and obviously my lips gone because it's eight in the car but bruh look at that like i've not even like been looking at myself my eyeliner has gone a tiny bit there but other than that my eyeliner's still perfect good old inglot and yeah my skin looks stunning man it looks stunning looks so good <laughs> i'm impressed with my own skills but yeah we're just gonna watch the um rest of the season like rest of the end of the season i guess of married at first sight in bed and just have cuddling stuff so i will speak to you guys tomorrow
Yeah, I can be forgot to say about that video when the guy's doing the wheelie on the bike. Like when I tell you they were doing that for like five, ten minutes solid, just all down the road. I was like, what is going on? Like, why did doing a wheelie for so long? Like, how was it even possible to do a wheelie for that long? I was like, what is going on? It was too funny. Hi guys, good morning. So I completely forgot to show you what I got yesterday. I was good. I didn't get a lot of stuff. I only got two things apart from Junior's present. That was really good behaviour for me. But I did buy yesterday some of Mitchell's new collection. Some of made by Mitchell new collection. So I was like, I need to behave myself. So I went into Superdrug and I ended up getting this concealer from Flower Beauty. Because it says, Light Illusion Full Coverage Concealer. Weightless feel, Crease Proof. And I was like, mm, sounds like a bit of me. And obviously like in Superdrug they have e.l.f. So I just picked up my e.l.f. concealer and like put it against the shades of this and like tried to find a shade that was like similar. So this is L34 Light. And yeah, I'm really, really intrigued to try this. I've always been really intrigued by Flower Beauty. Obviously like it's a big brand in America, but we've only just started to have it here in some super drugs. Um, so I'm really, really intrigued to try this and see if it's good. And then I'd love to try some other stuff from the brand. If you know, like, any good stuff from the brand, let me know down below. Um, I'd love to try. And then in Lush, it's now a snow fairy time. So Lush has brought out all their Christmas stuff. And listen, if you don't know about snow fairy, snow fairy is 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. It's like the best smell that they do um and i'm so happy i got one and everything i'm gonna be sharing with this and i'll probably buy a big one like the big one nearer to christmas so it lasts a while because these are the best they're expensive body washes but they last so long and like lush is the only body wash we use in this house period but yeah so those are the little things i got so we've like um isaiah actually like was having a good old cry last night he was like really overtired and he like cried from like half 11 till midnight and then he fell asleep and when and he stirred I think it was like light outside so he must have stirred around like five six in the morning and I got up and I went to the toilet and when I came back he was he was asleep so I was like oh like he's good I'll just get back into bed and like like because if he wakes up wakes up he'll cry um sometimes if it's been like a little while but no he was fine and I woke up and um to him like shuffling around and I looked over and he was awake. Like, he, he wakes up and he doesn't normally cry when he wakes up quite a lot of the time. So, yeah, he was just awake. He was sitting there sucking his thumb and everything. And I looked to turn my phone and it was nine o'clock in the morning. Bruh, this kid slept nine hours. This kid right here. This one right here. This one. This one slept nine hours last night. I can't believe it. <laughs> it's mental. So yeah, me and Junior got a full night's sleep, so we're feeling fresh. I'm just about to do Junior's hair. I'm about to twist it for him, and we're gonna watch some Married at First Sight. Pardon me while we do that. But yeah, I think we're just gonna have a chill day today. I've got some editing to do. I'm not gonna do a look today. I need to like, I've got like an idea of all the looks I want to do in October, but I just need to start like planning them out, like properly planning them out, and everything can like get today's post ready and all that kind of stuff. So it's kind of a just a chill day today, really. Isaiah's crib has just arrived. Junior's just on, gone down to get it and it's bringing it up. And hopefully I can just assemble it. It doesn't need like a drill or anything like that. Hopefully I can just do it on my own. So I'm going to assemble it and I'm so excited. He's going to sleep in his big boy pack tonight. So he's not going to sleep in our room. He's going to sleep in his crib tonight. Um, he normally only wakes up once a night, so it's not a big deal or anything like that. Um, but yeah, hopefully he likes it. I ordered one that didn't come with a mattress and for some reason they've sent a mattress so hopefully it's the right crib if not I'm gonna be pissed right so I think this is everything and then I've got the instructions here and the nice mess I don't know what it is about Argos but I always find that it comes with like so much stuff I think I've got everything out of the box I have the biggest like styrofoam phobia ever but i actually used to work like unpacking boxes so i kind of like semi know i have to get over it but like it goes through me like my mouth right now is like really dry and like moist and oh just styrofoam just goes through me i don't know what it is about it but it just goes through me so i'm just gonna give this a crack it looks like it literally just comes with the stuff like the screwdriver and everything to do it so I shouldn't have any problems. Um, I'm normally pretty good at putting furniture together. I can do most IKEA furniture without the instructions. So I'm gonna just have a look at the instructions and 
put her together she's gonna go like just there against the wall and now i have two mattresses but this one's a lot nicer so i'm probably just gonna layer them up or see if um i know anyone that will want this one um it does feel really thin and cheap but this one's a lot nicer this one's a foam spring mix and this one's quite expensive so I'm um, all done. It didn't take too long. Maybe like half an hour, 45 minutes ish. The instructions, I got some instructions. <laughs> they are always a mess, a mess, literally. Like, they're just terrible. I kind of, it was like half guesswork, half instructions. But I got that. It's all built. It's nice and sturdy. And now I can show you his room because his room's done now, really. Like, I just want to put some stuff up on the walls. And that's literally it. When you walk in, obviously, there's the sofa bed and there's his drawers with all of his clothes in and just some little bits in the cubby there. Then I've got his nappy bag, his sterilizer and his books. And then you come over here and he's got his nappy bin. Um, I think I'm going to put that up in here. It's like a little handprint when he was three months and a little picture of when he was in my tummy still. And then I'm going to put a little another picture in there. And then yes, this is the crib that I just built. So it comes with a changing table on the top. So I've just put his changing mat in there and he has a little terry towel in case he pees everywhere because he has a tendency to do that. I've got some wipes and then this is really good because it literally just slides which is so good and then obviously we've got his mattress and everything we've got a blanket and then he's got his little mobile and everything and then he's got I love you to the moon and back but yeah I also put like one of the buffer things around it um a lot of people like say not to put these because they're a choking hazard and stuff like that but I know my child and he's a wriggler and the last thing I want is for him to wriggle and then his arm to come through one of these and him like thing is arm or anything like that so i did get one just gonna know what my kids like and it is it's tied on there and it doesn't come up too high or anything so it's not gonna like collapse on him and suffocate him or anything like that and he's a bit older now and then yeah so i'm just gonna pop him in there in a second because he's actually sleeping right now but yeah i'm actually obsessed and he's just got some stuff that needs to go to um junior's friend who's about to have a baby and then he's got the bits that go on his buggy and his actual buggy is in the living room but yeah that is literally it let's go in and put him in his bed he looks so cute i can't deal look at him just in there all snuggled up with his blakey oh oh my god so isaiah says a plate and bowl and a little spoon arrived I got them on Amazon from Bamboo Bamboo and oh my god, it's literally the cutest thing ever. They literally come with like little suction things, suction onto his high chair and my heart just can't deal with how cute they are. Oh my god. So it's just like a little grey set I got. They come with all three. So like it comes as a set but like in different boxes. So got a little bowl you know and then there's the little spoon there. So Ooh. cute. Hey guys, good morning. So Isaiah slept in his own bed last night. He did wake up around 5 a.m. and I fed him and he vomited all over me, like really badly. Like he literally like all the milk he drank just vomited <laughs> everywhere. So yeah, that was that was fun. Um so I ended up having to change pajamas <laughs> in the middle of the night, like half asleep and clean him up and everything um and then like i just cuddled him for a while and gave him some more milk and then he went to sleep and everything so he likes it in his own bed like i can hear him fine from our room because junior was saying about getting a baby monitor but i can actually hear him fine from here because he's literally in the next room and if both doors are open then it's fine i can hear him but this morning I've just been cleaning, just sorted through Isaiah's clothes, like what doesn't fit him anymore and went into his bottom drawer and saw out there what will fit him now and like brought that up into his like current stuff. So I kind of know now like what I need to get for him to wear now. I just need to get him some white vests and like some more like little jumpers and stuff um and then i just need to start getting him six to nine month clothes because he doesn't really have any he has a few but not enough like for when he like turns that age and it'll be here before i know it so i definitely need to start getting him some six to nine month clothes but yeah i've just been like cleaning i just cleaned my desk and everything i think i'm gonna do another halloween look today um but right now i'm just gonna lay in bed and finish off all the editing that i've got to do and then like i'm ready to just focus on this look that i'm gonna do today hopefully i think robin is coming around later so june's gonna go pick him up later as this is just having his like 
um, lunchtime nap right now. So he's asleep in his little bed. But I'm so proud of him that he slept in his own bed. He loves it in there because he's got so much room to wriggle and everything. But yeah, I'll speak to you guys later. So I didn't do a look. <laughs> the look I was supposed to do because it's going to be long. It's going to be long. Like I've got to do my hair. I've got to do the makeup. I'm going to do a milk bath for it and everything. So it's going to be long. So I'm going to do it tomorrow and just have like all day, like start early and just do it. And Junior's going to look after his ears all day tomorrow. Um, yeah, so we're just going to go and pick up Junior's brother, Robin. He's going to stay for a little while. So you can see Isaiah's. Yes. Yes. Isaiah's got his new shoes that I got him on. I got him some little vans on eBay. I just bid for them on eBay. Only like a tenner, so bargain. He's got his little lammy. He's got his lammy little bear. Hey guys. <laughs> what are you doing, Isaiah? Isaiah's is like chewing his fingers. <laughs> Let me show you. Why you look so angry? Oh, oh. <laughs> his face. But yeah, I finally did that makeup look that I actually did a milk bar for today and now I'm just done at it. Like, I did the eye, I didn't like it, so I had to wipe it off and do it again. And it was just long, like, I'm so happy that it's over and done with now. I just need to like, edit everything and it's done. I'm just trying to like, make sure I'm way ahead on all this Halloween content because it's my anniversary on the 25th. And then on the 27th or 8th, we go to Cornwall for Halloween. So obviously I just want it all done and to not be stressed, but Robin is here. <laughs> and everything is like seven o'clock now. So I'm just doing some editing bits and everything. Isaiah is just, I don't know, he's just still staring. <laughs> he's, got, he's got his stare on or something. And then we're just gonna have dinner and everything. But yeah, hectic day today for me, for me. The milk bath, my neck is dead from the milk bath, literally dead. He literally keeps falling asleep in here. It's you. Oi! Where's this? <laughs> falling asleep. And he had a five hour nap and he slept 10 hours last night. And he's still tired. Please make it make sense. Look at him. He's just falling asleep right now. He's just falling asleep on camera. <laughs> hey guys. Good morning. It's like just gone 9 a.m. here. I've not vlogged in two, in two days, I'm not gonna lie. The day before yesterday, I was just so busy with like um, Instagram work and everything like that. Um, I was just crazy busy and then like I was in a really bad mood in the day as well. And like the last thing I want to do is like be in a mad, bad mood and be like, oh, this is what I'm doing today. And stuff. So I was in a really bad mood. And then yesterday I just kind of chilled. I just chilled, didn't we? I just had some downtime. And then my mum came last night. She's just in the shower now. Um, yeah, so we went to pick up my mum at like 10 last night and everything. So she's here at the moment, isn't she? Is your bubby here? Yes, she is. <laughs> um, yeah, and yeah, I was, I've just been, last two days I've just been in like loads of work and loads of editing. I've really not been doing anything exciting. Um, and then I had like loads and loads of PR come as well. And then I had to unbox that and everything. And then like, I got this like scoop thing for his bath toys and everything so we've been having like nice baths together which has been really really cute and then it's like a scoop thing i'll put a picture of it here it's got an amazon like you just scoop up all of his bath toys and it just like drains it's like the best thing ever it's so so good but today we are about to go to the supermarket to get you some food to eat mommy's gonna make you num nums yes so it's gonna be isaiah since first day of food gonna be his first day of food today like human food so we're super super excited so we're just gonna go to the supermarket and get some stuff for breakfast for us and him and some food for him for the rest of the day and everything but yeah i will definitely show you like what he eats and stuff like we're doing baby led weaning so he's not having puree he is having food but yeah let's go to the shop hmm? Huh, you are eggy bread. What's this? Ooh. <laughs> He's looking at it like, oh, what is that? What is that? Like, Everyone's what? looking like, at him. Why is everyone watching me? <laughs> <laughs> like, what is a fucking bottle? <laughs> why is everyone watching me? Who's that? 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 Oh, <laughs> what's he's like, this? He's like, this is dead. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> he's not winning as much at the moment, is he? Yeah, it's not been as much. Oh. As 
sickle gonna not a bottle, don't worry. <laughs> yeah. no oh! When your mum comes to stay and brings you the biggest ham ever! ever. <laughs> Big ham! We have a Cornish ham! <laughs> and makes you mac and cheese. Yummy, 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 yummy. So Isaiah is going to have some chicken and broccoli for dinner. I'm just going to put him in his high chair now. Oh, this is a crispy turkey. Ooh, chick-chick. Yeah. It tastes what? Ooh, chicken. It's like sweet, but I don't know if that's the actual flavor that I'm supposed to be describing. Um, Just be careful. It tastes better. All kind of cabbage stuff is better when you roast it. It takes that pungentness out of it, I reckon. Well, Will it into his mouth? He's looking at it very, very intently. He's like, what is this? What is this? Huh? What is it? Mm, he did pretty good. He definitely ate some. Hey guys, good morning. So, had a lion this morning. I guess he's having his nap right now. But yeah, I just wanted to say what a week has been. It's been pretty crazy. I just can't believe that Isaiah is now eating big boy food and i can't wait to go on like the baby led weaning journey with you guys and see how it goes and everything he did actually end up eating quite a little bit last night actually which was really really good um he had some chicken and even some broccoli <laughs> he definitely preferred chicken to broccoli but obviously he's always going to have like preferences and stuff and stuff to see how it goes and it's just like so exciting as a mum to like be able to finally feed my baby like something that's not milk <laughs> So I'm super, super excited and I'm sure there'll be loads of different things that he's eating next week and stuff. But yeah, love you guys so, so much and hope you enjoyed this week with me and I will see you next week. Hope you're having a great lunch, brunch, dinner, whatever it is, wherever you are. Bye guys. Mwah.